What's up, folks? Applied Energistics RV 13.8 A is now available, apparently. You know, if that's the only update we need, then we are doing pretty good. We're pretty up-to-date here. Um, anyway, I said I was going to switch back to default because there are like some invisible stuff, but I haven't done it yet because I just finished recording the other episode. Anyway, um, in other news, what happened to last episode? Well, we did some more research, and we got this thingy going here, the Crucible, and it's got boiling water, so it's good. So now I can show you guys uh, the Night War. How making a night war works. How making stuff in the Thalmanamicon works. Different things require... Oh, look, it actually... Well, no, it kind of works, but... Uh, rec making different things requires different things. Some things are made on the work table. Some things are made in the crucible. Uh, some things are even made on a different thing we haven't discovered yet. Uh, we need to discover this to build it. But anyway, the night war. So if you click on something, it'll tell you how to make. So this, all we need is five Vs, simple... Uh, four Ignis, six Lux, and four Potentia. So that's pretty simple. Uh, what did I have? All right, so Cole has two Ignis and two Potentia. So two of that would be four Ignis and four Potentia. Um, so that's good. All right, so now all we need is six Lux, and a candle has one, so six candles. So here's what we're going to do. We are going to... Oh man, I don't have any room in my inventory because I had to separate these things. You know, we'll just throw the bucket on the ground for now. We'll pick it back up later. So all you need to do is go to the crucible and you need to throw. You need to have a wand with 50, at least uh, the five Vs or whatever it is. And then you just need to throw the elements into this thing. So uh, the six torches. And then it'll make that boiling sound. And then uh, the two coal. And then you right click, and it will give you your item, which apparently is invisible. Uh, let me be able to get to it. Alright, and I'm pretty sure I picked it up. Yes, here it is. It's a night ore. Let's see if it works. Oh, yes, it does work. Okay, so that is what a night ore looks like right there. It's basically, yeah, it's like a little magical kind of looking thing there. So there you go. Now, let me cover up this. we go. Yeah, and uh, that also takes up the water in the crucible, so now we will need to, you know, refill that back up if we want to use it again. Let me grab the iron out of here. Oh, man. My thing is full. Damn it! Um, can we go delete mode on some of this stuff? I said I wanted to keep the zombie brains, though. Okay, guys, I'm back. I slept to get rid of the night. Also, I'm going to do this right now. We are going to change back to default. It's really the only reliable texture pack because there's always going to be ones that are missing textures. So, screw it, you know, just screw it, really. Applied Energistics. All right, so this is what our shitty house looks like in default texture but hey at least we can see everything in our items now which is great all right so night or is right here yeah it looks really crazy uh, let's throw our where's my iron dust there it is so this is a night or um, I actually want to move want to move this over here And we can throw our night ore right on top of it as a little torch thing there. So we don't really need this torch there. And we could use this to light up our whole house. The thing is, it just costs Vs. Um, we could also put our, just put our wand there. It'll sit there on that. So there you go. That's night ore. That's what it looks like. It's pretty cool. It's basically like torch, but all magical and floating, and it's pretty badass. So I like it. Um, let's dump some stuff in here that I don't need at the moment. These we do need to plant right away. And we need it to be semi-close to the house because silver wood is what produces Vs and it will also keep the wisps away. And it will also keep us from getting poisoned if... because if there's a large amount of um, that stuff that you release from researching in the area and not enough Vs via the uh, silver wood trees or whatever, then you will start getting poisoned. And that's no fun. So, anyway, um, alright, let's do some more research, shall we? So let's throw some in there. Something I like to throw in there quite often is, I'm going 
talum, which iron has. A lot of it has eight. Uh, so let's grab some from here. And, uh, yeah, because that will eventually lead to the stuff we need. So it's going to use a lot of it. Okay. Oh, discover it. Yes, there we go. All right, so this one is basic transmutation, which is really good because that is going to open up a lot of other things we can discover. But something I don't like is usually when you discover this first element, it'll show you what the other elements are so that you can like just get find stuff that has them and do it. But sometimes it won't, and it'll still show obscurious here. So you got to figure out what it is. So basic transmutation, what else would it have? Um, that is a great question indeed. Well, let's see if it has any of this simple stuff maybe. Nope. Shitter, shitter on my bitter. Well, we could use these fire shards. Maybe get lucky. Nope. All right, fine. Uh, you know what? It probably has permutatio. Yeah, it does. Okay. Using a bunch of copper ore here. There's probably more. A better way to do this but I don't care. Alright, there we go. We got it. Alright, and it still doesn't even show me the last element, the dick. Uh, it can't be that one because, you know, Cobblestone has that. It didn't have it. Um, I doubt it's either of these two, but let's give it a shot. Yeah, of course not. It never is. Uh, did I do something with Ignis yet? Uh, I could try my cooked pork chops. Oh, yeah, we already tried Ignis. Mm. Thalmon Amicon has a lot of elements. It's really good. Oh, wow, it is the Karis one. That's weird. Did not expect that. Yeah, you get a lot from the rubies because it has four, but that's it. Now we're out of it. All right, so we got to find something else that has Karis. Get us, get us, get us, get us. Not a lot of things have that, so that might be hard to find. Oh man, Glowstone Dust has three Lux. That's probably the best one to use for Lux. Oh man, bows have a lot. Damn. Bows are good. Okay, it looks like we don't have anything in there that has Karis. Whoa, look at that flower one. Huh. Of course the flowers have the flower one. Uh, Lapis has some. Do we really want to get rid of our valuable Lapis? Lapis is hard to come by. Well, if I don't have anything else that has it, then yeah, we don't have a choice but to use the Lapis. And we don't. So, Lapis it is. Alright, fine. Just It's close, so maybe we'll be alright. There we go. We didn't even have to use any Lapis. Very good. And that's basic transmutation. Oh, no. Uh, by studying the rudiments of alchemy and the properties of metals, you think you might have stumbled upon a way to transform base metals into gold. Right, so transmutation opens up a whole nother... Well, it doesn't show here, actually, but there's like five types of metals that you can transmute into gold here, so those are all going to open up for exploration now, which is stupid. Oh man, this one's still freaking out, but look, it uh, looks like the rest of these fix themselves, all these pictures. But anyway, what we want to research now, the thing we want to research is over here in Tier 2. This whole area is the Tier 2 research. And the only way you can open up Tier 2 is by finishing the end Tier 1 research, which is this. And to unlock this, we need to discover these two. And to discover these two, we need to discover the ones across from them. So we've got this one, so we can start discovering this one, but I don't know what triggers it. But basically, we just want to try to get these. So I'm going to try and see if I can figure out a way to get that going. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm actually going to throw some zombie rings in there because that yields pretty weird elements. Right, it has the Cognito. Thaumometer, oh, that's a good one. All right, do we have anything that has Cognito as well? Cognito. Uh, nothing in there. Um, well, the Enchanted Book has six. But who wants to give up the Enchanted Book? Oh, Knowledge Fragments. Yeah, Knowledge Fragments are which I have the most. They have 16 of that, but Knowledge Fragments are hard to come by. 
And there you go, it didn't even get us there, so that sucks. Alright, there's got to be something else that has Cognito. Didn't I already... And you know what, books probably have it. Like regular books, do I have any regular books though? I don't think so. Uh, la 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 la. Oh, I, do, I have five more knowledge fragments right here. Check that out. All right. Cool beans. Yeah, look at that. That's good stuff. Okay, so yeah, thalmometer. Um, you can also look up on the wiki if you want to to see what things have what aspects, but it's really kind of fun to do it yourself, but I'm just going to do it here just so you know. It'll show it. Um... Research by aspect. Yeah, there's a page on the wiki called Research by Aspect, and that will show most of what is required to make normal stuff. So this one has the Cognito, which we just got, Precantatio, and Machina. A lot of things have Precantatio, uh, but which ones do we have that have it? Uh, well, that pickaxe has 20. Uh, shards are a good way to get that, but... Shards are hard to come by, so normally they won't go very far. Yeah, got us to about 62%. That's actually pretty good. Uh, oh, yeah, Silverwood Logs are probably the best one, because they come by two, and those are really easy to come by. And it revealed the Machina to us. Now, the question is, what do I have that has Machina? That I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure what the best, like, way of getting Machina is, but... That's another thing you can look up on the wiki, and it's a very useful thing called List of Aspects. You can find that on the wiki, and this one's not really cheating. This one, you just it'll show you what all the aspects and what contains those aspects. So you can look up the easiest way to get it. So we'll scroll down to Machida. L M. All right, so buttons, fence gates, iron doors, mine carts, nickelite, redstone, redstone repeaters, redstone torch, wooden doors, and pressure plates have machina. So it seems like the easiest thing that has that would be redstone. Yes, and redstone has two. And redstone is quite plentiful, so that's probably the best thing for this. And there we go. And booyah, we have discovered... The Thalmometer! You believe this mystical device will point you in the direction of nearby sources of mystical energy. Right. Oh, that's the glitchy one. Alright. Yeah, it's supposed to just be the circle. But whatever. Alright, this is the one I want to find here. And this one is called uh, Magical Building Blocks. That's the one. And I'm pretty sure it has a lot of aspects. And I think one of them is the tree one. So if I could just... I know I've got to have, I had something with the tree one. Well, this one, obviously, but it might take from the Precantatio, but we'll find out. But it has, oh, yep, it did take from the Precantatio, that fucker. And another bad thing is when it doesn't reveal the, uh, what research it is here once you get a thing. But this one did, so Thaumaturge's robes. Uh, Thaumaturge's robes are... Probably going to have the Fabricio one, which is the um, Panis. So I'm going to see what has Panis. All right, it probably has Panis and Fabrico. Uh, beds have 17. Wow. Uh, bows, wool has 6. Or white wool has 7. Non-white wool has 6. String. All that stuff works really good for it. So uh, na, 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 na. we'll use this bow. Use it up. And it probably won't get us very far. Yeah. But it will get us there. So now if we got to see if we have any wool or leather or string. Whoops. Uh, let's sleep first. I don't want monsters spawning. And we'll do more research in the day. Oh, I have a chest over here. I haven't been looking in. Holy crap, dude. Look at all this stuff. Uh, yeah. Okay. String. There we go. Is some string. Oh, well, there goes all the string. Uh, don't have any more string. We have wool, though. Alright. 
So non-white wool is better because it gives you, uh, or no, white wool gives you seven. So white wool is better than non-white wool for this. Come on, get there. Come on, you're at 93%, homie. Jeez Louise, took me down to one wool. All right, and it reveals the last one, which is two to men. Two to men sucks. It's one of the worst. Uh, so there's only very few things that have it, and that the reason that's the reason it sucks. So there's enchanted books, um, armor, leather, potion of fire resistance, and redwood bark, and that's it. That's all that has it. So mostly the thing you'll find yourself doing a lot is just making low-level armor with uh, things and using that. Oh, I had some non-white wool in here. Look at that. But I want to see, do we have any leather? Leather, leather. I do have an enchanted book, but I'd like to save it. And I don't think we have any leather. We do not. So what I will do is I will take some of this iron we got here. And I'll just make some boots. Five pairs of boots. Um, I'll just throw that on the ground. I'll come pick it back up in a second. And that gives you three two It comes with 26 metallum, which is good. But it's just not viable because, as you can see, these things can get consumed in, like, one click and not give you anything. And sometimes they'll take you really far, like that one, but sometimes they won't. There you go. All right, let's pick that up. Okay, and that is Thaumaturge's robes. Oh, well. You've discovered a way to create magical cloth. Now you need to discover what you can do with it. The obvious choice seems to be clothing. Right, Thaumaturge's robes we could make. What do they do? Well, that's what this is for. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. They also hold mystical enchantments very well and can hold powerful magic much better than expensive armor. So that's pretty good. It's pretty much just like magical armor. Which is good to have. Um, I'm going to try the tree one again. Oh, this one only has trees, so this has to give it to Oh, it's not even going to give it to us, is it? It's not even going to give it to me as an option. Yeah, it's not even going to start the research. What a dick. What a dick. Oh, well, I guess we'll just go with one with the precantatio. See what it gives us. Thaumium. Oh, Thaumium is good to research because that's that's like the blocks that is gonna make everything in here. Alright, so what else does Thaumium have? Well, we could check the research by aspects if we want, but I don't think it's gonna show it here. Yeah, no, it's not. But maybe if I look it up it will. Uh, well, obviously it's going to have metallum, that's pretty obvious, because it is a metal, it's pretty much an ingot, so natural that it would have that, and it might show us the last aspect once we, oh my god, this thing is eating up my iron. Oh yeah, there it is, permutatio. I got screwed on that iron consumption, but we can use the boots as some iron as well. Look at that, just sapped it up. This thing has 26, and it just sapped it up like that. Alright, permutatio, what has a lot of permutatio? I could check. I could check. Uh, eggs have four. That's probably a good. Uh, seeds have a lot. Pumpkin seeds. Yeah, it looks like seeds are the best way to go. Copper ore has some as well. That's what I got right now. I don't have any seeds, so I'm going to go with the copper ore. We're just going to abuse our copper ore right now just because I don't need it yet. And there we go. That is thaumium. You found a way to infuse and transform base metals with raw magical energy. You're hopeful that the resultant material will prove stronger, more resilient than its components. Ah, uh, yes, and that is thaumium right there. And this is one of the best things, because this is used to pretty much make everything. So that opens up a lot. This is going to open up this thing, which is what I wanted to make. And then once we discover this, all the lines connecting to this will be ready. So then we can discover this. Um, and it looks like all this is ready, so we can discover that as well. I don't know what that is, but... This is the important thing, because this is what we need to make an infusion altar, which is what we're going to need to build the item that I want to build later. So that's good. So I'm going to see if we can get that going. It only I know it has tree, and not a lot of things have tree, so we'll see if we can force it here by giving it something that only has tree. Nope, it gave me the scoop instead. Damn it, scoop, man. Well, that's okay. We're going to work on the scoop later. We'll uh, finish that research another time. But for right now, we're out of time on this episode, so... I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Minecraft TB. See you guys then.